Drums are obviously the coolest instrument on the planet, but they also have some obvious drawbacks. Today we're going to talk about the five worst things about the drums. Okay, number five, the bass drum. I'm not really going to do this in a British accent. Okay, so uh, they're huge. It's the biggest, heaviest thing that you have to carry around. It takes up a ton of space. You have to play it with like a ridiculous pedal contraption that's hard to operate. Uh, tuning it means you got to like pick it up and take it off the kit. And miking it is super difficult. Um, and really, no one can hear it anyway. It just gets lost in the mix. So number four is the snare drum. Seems like a good idea. It's an expressive instrument. It's the centerpiece of your kit. You spend lots of money uh, upgrading to a really high quality, fancy snare drum with a lot of resonance and depth of tone. And then basically, you start putting tape on it, and then you put little dampening on it, then you put a lot of dampening on it, and in the end, you just end up throwing your wallet on it and choking it out anyway. So a lot of money and time tuning it for no real gain. Number three is sticks. So of course you have to have sticks. In fact, you have to have bags and bags full of every type of stick and mallet on the planet. Uh, and then they're really hard to hold on to. And so you end up trying to tape them and then you try to buy the ones with the grippy handles, but turns out they don't make the ones you like with the grippy handles. And in the end, you've spent $100 on sticks and they just break. They're disposable items. How annoying. And number two, we have symbols. So everyone needs symbols, uh, like especially your ride symbol and your hi-hat, very expressive, essential parts of your kit. As you can see here, just four symbols, not even a big setup worth, can run you over $1,800. And then, once you've dropped all that cash, not a full drum set, just the symbols, they break and you turn out to find, oh, they're actually disposable just like sticks. Also, everyone hates the sound of symbols except drummers, so why bother? Okay, so the number one most worst annoying thing about the drums is other musicians. Singers are divas, guitar players never want to stop soloing and it takes them forever to tune and they're dragging down rehearsal time. Bass players, they're late to everything and they're hard to find anyway, so you kind of have to tolerate it. And then there's the drummer jokes. They just think that you're an idiot back there and you don't play a real instrument anyway. So basically, those are the five worst things about the drums. If you made it this far, you realize it's pretty much a joke. I like the drums, but thanks for watching anyway.